watching 7 News Today in New England. Ever circle a city street for what seems like hours looking for a parking space? It can be a pain. Sure is. Well, now some uh, Boston University grads have come up with a new high-tech tool that could show you where all those open parking spaces are. Sounds really good. <laughs> Seven's Julie O'Claire has more now. I don't know about you, but the last time I went to Logan, I ended up driving around for 20 minutes. Parking is awful. I told them to take cabs everywhere. Welcome to Boston parking. No spot here. Double parked for hours there. Let's face it, it's all backed up. Ever wish there were a secret to finding an open space? Well, the solution could be right around the corner. Four BU engineers came up with a groundbreaking device. It's called iSpot. He pulls in and the software detects that he's occupying this spot and marks it as red, which means full. Here's how it works. Small surveillance cameras hooked to a computer program find where the cars are and are not. This is a map of a parking lot. For this demonstration, iSpot's cameras are watching these six spaces in the lot. When a space is green, that means one of iSpot's cameras spies no cars in the space, so green means the space is empty. When a car pulls into the space, the camera detects it and the space turns red. This means the space is full. Say the whole parking lot's full, this would represent that, you know, we have one spot left. That same image could be streamed to your cell phone, PDA, or GPS in your car. So you'll be alerted to the open space while driving. We kind of model the thing for large-scale parking lots, mostly after Logan Airport. The young inventors say it could work in a shopping mall and even in a city block. Cameras could be attached to a building and could watch a number of parking meters. I can't see how it wouldn't be set up in an urban area. For this demo, iSpot worked pretty well, but if a person walked into the space, it would say a car was in the spot. The software's still a little finicky at this point. Sometimes it'll show something that's empty, but it usually corrects itself fairly quickly. The design won first place in a national engineering contest, and a number of financial backers have come calling. So when will we be able to use it? I can't imagine it would be more than two or three years. So in the meantime, we're still stuck circling and rubbernecking. Oh, here's a space. Julie Eau 7 News. All right, now that sounds cool, but what if everybody has the same gadget and you're all entering the parking garage at the same time? You're still all going for the same Big spot. Big brawl. It'll look like the Jets' <laughs> giant scrimmage from yesterday then, right? I can't, I can't imagine why they'd need this in government center because there's no parking problems here at all, right, Not Pete? at all. I can't figure it out myself. I was just scratching my head over that. Yeah.